Hi, my name is Julie Lunt and I've recently graduated uh, from a degree studying biochemistry. A typical day for me um, with the biochemistry was probably just a three hour lecture uh, to begin with and they are basically whittled down then in the second and third years to about an hour and a half. A lot of practical work is involved but it's really really enjoyable so you do get those practical skills as well. For me, because I'm a much older student, I would do a lot of my study from home. However, you have got the library resources because they're right on your doorstep if you live in halls. But I used to use the off-campus, which is basically a desktop at home, which was really, really good for me because I've got a family. The challenges, the different challenges, the variety, um, it's great because no two days are ever the same. They're always different, you're always meeting new people, um, new lecturers, every, every, all of them are different. So for, you, for me, I prefer the variety rather than mo the monotony of anything else you do. Um, I applied for a role as a student advocate. There was a lot of variety there. We, got to, we get to do a lot of different things. You meet great people from all backgrounds, ages. Um, I found it really, really, really good and I've learned so much as well from just being a student advocate outside of the degree. The most difficult thing, um, which I did anticipate before, prior to the degree, was handling your finances properly because you, you obviously you get your loans and your grants and because they come in four instalments it's very easy to just go and spend even if you are a responsible mature student that is difficult and it's not like you're getting a wage every every month so you you can write all this down on paper and then of course you you may take a part-time job for a while but you may not be able to keep that on because you've got to fit that in around your modules and study which change from year to year. So that is quite difficult. Time management is probably at the top of the list. I've learned over the last five years that I've been studying that it's so important to manage your time properly. Make your plan, but don't overstudy. You must take at least one day off a week because if you are overwhelmed you won't be able to think properly anyway so it's really important to yes study put a timetable together um, if it's the library if it's books for you use books if you prefer electronic studying that's absolutely fine but it's important to take time out usually for me I always take a day off and do no study at all